Hello preschool friends. I hope you got a chance to enjoy the weather again today. It's warming up. Today our book is Pandora, written and illustrated by Victoria Turnbull. It used to be a library book. Not anymore. Pandora lived alone. So this is Pandora. At school we talked about how it looks like she lives in a junkyard. In a land of broken things. So this is her house. Way over here. Look at all these mountains of garbage. Okay. Here we go. She made herself a handsome home from all that people had left behind. But no one ever came to visit. So she built her own house. This is on the inside of her house. She's recycled a lot of materials. So she spent her time gathering and repairing what she could, bringing lost and forgotten things back to life. So in this picture, she's sewing a teddy bear to make it better. And she fixed it. That's something to be proud of. Then, one day. Something fell from the sky. It was broken too. But Pandora didn't know how to fix it. It's a little blue bird. So she made it as snug as she could and watched over it through the night. And here they are. She's curled around it and they're both snoring. Pandora's guest was a little weak at first. But as the days went by, he grew stronger. Soon he could hop about and then fly short distances. So here he is when he started to fly a little bit. That was nice of her to help him get better. She could have just left him. Then he might not have gotten better if she did that. But he always came back with gifts from faraway lands. He always came back. So I see a variety of plants that he's bringing back and putting in that box that she first put him in. Until the day he didn't. One day he didn't come back. How do you think that made Pandora feel? What do you think the bird could be doing? Once again, Pandora was alone. She looks sad in that picture. I can't see her face, but her head is down. That makes me think she feels sad. Oh, she thought her heart would break. She's really sad. I bet she misses him. Maybe she's really worried about him, too. But I noticed something happening down here in this box. Do you see what I see? This is the box that he always brought things back to. But day by day, the world appeared a little less gray. Pay attention here. That plant is growing. There's lots of plants growing, actually. So the seeds that that bird planted inside of this box, they're growing. Until one morning, Pandora woke in the warmth of the sun. She doesn't feel so sad anymore, I don't think. And look at this is taking over her bedroom. Maybe that's what woke her up. So it's right above her bed now, too. I noticed also that she's been sleeping with that teddy bear she fixed at the beginning of the book. You see it laying in her bed. So it looks like Pandora's getting out of bed and she's going outside. Oh, and she heard the sound of bird song. Look who came back. Look at where she lives, too. It doesn't look all garbagey anymore. There's plants. And here's Pandora with that little bluebird. 
in a land of living things. Oh, it looks beautiful. This is somewhere that I would I wouldn't mind living. Especially with these little buddies, so cute. Oh, and they recycled a tire to make a tire swing. That's fun. All right, that's the end. Look at all the plants on the back. I hope you get a chance to play outside again tonight. It's so nice outside. It's beautiful. This is my favorite weather. I will read you guys another book tomorrow. I hope to see you on our Zoom. I love and miss you guys.